W-R-I-T-E. W-R-I-T-E. That's how Kyle spells it. <laughs> this was for sure an incredible summer. You could go to the point and get a free hummer. The pontoon boat rides across the pit. Does anyone know who covered Fernando's camper with shit? Charlie's slipping us all a microchip, so he's always aware of where we are and when we get there. His early morning rides to give us the nightly scoop. If it wasn't for Charlie, we would not be in the loop. On the nights that we're out to have a little fun, the moonshine shows up and then we're all done. <laughs> Michelle, on the other hand, is so quiet and sweet. Shows up quietly and slips you a pudding or jello shot to eat. Golf cuts have definitely been an issue this season. Bob got broken ribs, a black eye, and still doesn't know the reason. <laughs> then there was Callan and Steph just sitting around till Callan punched the gas pedal right to the ground. Like a bat out of hell, he scooped up Kyle, riding the windshield for a little while. <laughs> When it was all said and done, it was just a short trip. It will go down as the day Kyle almost broke a hip. <laughs> Remember the night Rasta was drunk on the loose and poor Larry drank too much of Charlie's moonshine juice? They disappeared and the search was on. Thanks to them, Dennis is gone. <laughs> the Chinese food restaurant called looking for their things. Who doesn't love karaoke when Larry sings? Bob's homemade salsa is sure to please. The girls won the kickball game. It was a breeze. Cinder became the activities girl. Sue's legs are so hairy they're starting to curl. <laughs> the, dem the demise of Paul's famous denim cargo jorts, the Rogers family with all their sports. Since Karen Ann was added to our group text, we are not sure what she will do next. She used to be in control and followed the rules. Poor Karen Ann now acts like us fools. <laughs> Steph likes her beer out of a glass. Look out for Eileen, she will kick your ass. <laughs> a bite to the face and the relationship sank. <laughs> If you want to see Gary, he lives at Commerce Bank. <laughs> Mo Greno can be found wearing her comfy Sophie shorts, and in case you didn't know, she hates losing at sports. Has anyone seen the pessary that belonged to Granny? That's the thing that goes in her jazz hole. I think she was drunk when it fell out, now she stuck it in her fanny. <laughs> Pajama bottoms are Timmy Greno's thing. If you want a martini, just give him a ring. The night we all posted his pic to Facebook, there was something not right about that frontal look. <laughs> We are glad to have Joe and Jen join us this year. Jen fell down the stairs and didn't even shed a tear. <laughs> Bob Hoppin', Hoppin' in Hyannis was a really fun night. Joe just sits back and watches. He's oh, he never uptight. <laughs> Hung over the next day was good old Eddie. To start drinking again, he just wasn't ready. On the golf cart he was flying, he didn't even care, trying to catch a bit of fresh air. There are so many memories I could go on forever. Some things we promised to mention never. As we sit by the fire, this is the end of my roast. Raise your drinks for a season and a final toast. To this great group of people, you know who you are. We've become great friends No, who know how to have fun. We've become great friends. It will never be done. Here's to the people we now call friends. It's times like this you hope never end. There's a song today if anyone has a guitar. <laughs> 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 <laughs>